hello, Ravensworth community and beyond. Last Easter, I had uh, read a reflection on the um, uh, scripture, Luke 23, 46. Father, into your hands, I commit my spirit. And I had, I had spoken last year, this same time, Easter time, about how my reading of it had changed. I had recognized Jesus as um, willingly, positively giving, committing his spirit, as opposed to, um, uh, I guess, the, the negative drug himself into slash gave up. And um, so this year, after all that's gone down, I've kind of come to the realization that and, and re-reflecting on this a year later, after all that we've been through, I kind of came to the realization that commit also has a new sense for me and uh, and that it might resonate with you as well. So um, when I'm writing, I have a, a bad habit of putting a forward slash between words when I can't think of the exact word I want. I'll pick two or three, separa uh, separate them with a forward slash, to kind of give the color or sense or meaning that I'm looking for. And um, then, uh, you know, move on from there. It's not the, it's, it's a bad habit I like to break, but I haven't gotten there yet. So um, when I was reading this this year, I think that my forward slash on commit is um, to surrender. Not surrender as in giving up and waving the flag, but surrender as in um, giving in to trying to control, direct, um, change outcomes, and, and truly just letting it be, knowing that Jesus has got me, and um, it's going to be all right, that I can, I can commit to slash surrender um, my desire to uh, control the future and the outcomes because, you know, I learned this year that's, that's not ever happening. So I wanted to, uh, um, kind of share that, uh, revelation, if you will, that, uh, understanding that I've come to about this with you. And, uh, so I'll just read again, Luke 23, 46, father into your hands, I commit slash surrender, slash give in to my desire and to control the future. And I will give that spirit over to God. Amen.